This also comes in handy, this uh, American flag hoodie, because today is uh, is American Redneck Day. Uh, this is also Air Conditioning Appreciation Day, International Plastic Bag Free Day, Fried Clams Day, Chocolate Wafers Day. Good Lord, not together, please. <laughs> it's Independent Beer Run Day. And... <laughs> it, it is uh it's start the conversation day a day to check in with a loved one about their mental health uh, don't be afraid to start a conversation about it and finally greg i i know it's july 3rd but it is still july yeah. it is still what month is this it's lasagna oh, awareness month a, a lasagna where <laughs> folks dr lyerly selena i Brittany, you and i we we talked about this yesterday our our are you aware of lasagna? Are you aware of it? I'm aware that Costco has one, and I love to pick it up and just pop it in my oven. It's really just yes or no. We can't, yes. Doctor, I don't mean to, to she's, belie she's your, your, your for Congress. She wants to filibuster I'm, here. Just want to yes or no answer here. Uh, it, lasagna is around us, for us, by us, <laughs> and sometimes within us. And it's just important to know that you need to be aware of lasagna in this july the year of our lord 2024 i wish whoever decided to name it lasagna awareness month could appreciate how much they're being dragged for the entire month here on this fine radio show wait, wait, uh, wait. why july because who wants to heat up the kitchen that, that's exactly uh, what i was thinking but yes. i'm a lasagna in slow cooker i don't know that I, i'm not making lasagna in july I don't hey uh -uh. i have an idea the lasagna people got together with the air conditioning appreciation people you <laughs> heat up the kitchen you turn on the ac you drive up those bills and then everyone gets our money the conspiracy. <laughs> it's yeah. all it's all connected somehow rob from tigerton says i have a red white and blue shirt it says make lawns great again <laughs> uh, of course it does uh in tigerton it's cloudy and 63 uh, another 1.1 inches of rain on tuesday i want to wish pat a very happy birthday i hope it is a great day the song you should play on your bumper rotation is it's raining again by super tramp which takes us to Brittany Merlot, because yes, uh, the the rain, rain, rain can, is going to continue to come down, down, down on people's plans for the, probably what, the fourth and the fifth, by and large? I'm pretty much like, hey, we've got all these days off. Let, let's mm -hmm. just let have it rain, right? Yeah, Mother yep. Nature, goodness. Long mm -hmm. weekend, definitely going to be dampened here, especially um, ugh, on the fourth and the fifth. So we are looking at that rainfall moving in. So dry today. If you have any plans, you're good to go. It's going to be actually a little bit muggy as we head through the afternoon, mostly sunny and temperatures climbing anywhere from those low 80s to even the upper 80s. So feeling nice and summery, but then as soon as tomorrow, we are looking at clouds pushing in by the afternoon and some rain starting to roll in as well. We're looking at storm chances that could be strong to severe in the western parts of the state by tomorrow afternoon. Then they look to weaken as they push in and become more numerous statewide, but they could still be strong. They could still have some heavy downpours and they are going to linger into our Friday as well. They start to scatter out and lessen out by Friday night. And then Saturday, we will see a mix of sun and clouds, but spotty showers and storms still linger on occasion throughout the afternoon on Saturday. And that's the case on Sunday too, unfortunately. So honestly, pack and expect and prepare for some sort of rain and storms to definitely hit you this weekend. Have a plan, unfortunately. Um, rainfall totals, yeah, we've got two inches into some areas just yesterday. We've got another one to two inches expected again from Thursday night and then through our Friday. Right now, the heaviest hit looks like west, central Wisconsin areas, but again, it's who's underneath those storms. And the biggest chances for the storms, and as I'm looking at the firework timing and all of that right now, it does look like central Wisconsin, northern Wisconsin. It kind of stretches all through the south. So everyone's got a chance, and I hate saying that, but I know that they'll work around it. We'll have a good time anyways, and it doesn't matter. It's all about family, friends, and celebrating the nation's independence. So right. sorry, Mother Nature. You can't ruin it. <laughs> right. and, and look, if, if if people can push anything till Saturday or Sunday, then, you know, hopefully you got a better shot at better weather then. Absolutely. But we'll, you know, it, it is what it is, and we'll just make our plans accordingly. Greg's already altered his barbecue plans so that he can still get that grill working. So Good. you just, you roll with it. So Absolutely. All right, Brittany. Thank you. Have a, a great extended weekend. I'll see you next Monday. Sounds good. Thank you.